Well, good morning, South Florida. I'm Andrew Perez. Here's a look at stories making news on this Saturday morning. The Broward County Sheriff's Office has released body camera video of a deadly deputy involved shooting. This is in Pompano Beach. A transit employee called 911 after officers say a mechanic killed his coworker. Video shows deputies in action at the Broward Transit bus attempting to take down Rafael Molina after he fired at officers six times. Officers returned fire 49 times, killing the 59 year old. Deputies say the gunman targeted his employee. The three deputies are now on paid leave. A man shot by Miami police now recovering at the hospital. Donald Armstrong was shot after waving what appeared to be a sharp object. The police shooting happened Thursday at a home at Northwest 7th Court and 58th Street. Officers say they tasered Armstrong twice, then fired at least 10 shots. The 47-year-old remains stable at Jackson Memorial Hospital, but is also in critical condition. New spring break enforcement rules are now in effect in Miami Beach. Officers were seen posted on every corner Friday along with barricades, warning signs. In recent years, officers have made nearly 600 arrests annually during spring break. We've also got this, a crime on camera as a burglar steals from a South uh, Miami restaurant. Surveillance video shows him using a tool to break into the Rice Mediterranean Kitchen on South Dixie Highway and Southwest 71st Street last month. Officers say he disconnected all the computers, took two cash registers, and stole close to 800 bucks. Investigators also believe he committed two other similar burglaries that same night. Remember, as breaking news happens, we've got you covered on air, but also online. You can head to our website, local10.com for more.